So I got both uh, both frames glued up, and they're in the house drying. So happy. Uh, I was actually, I you know, frankly, I didn't think I'd get. I, I really didn't think that <clears throat> I would get this far this weekend. I thought I'd, if I was lucky, I'd get all the tenons cut and be ready for assembly uh, sometime during this week or or uh, next weekend but I was able to get all the tenons cut and fit did my assembly today and slowly at that uh, well rounded off the tenons the lower tenons <clears throat> and did the glue up uh, now I'm just those are inside I got about I don't know maybe maybe an hour or so left of, uh, of daylight so now I'm I forgot how long it takes to square crap lumber from from uh, you know lumber yards or you know construction lumber um, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and get to it. This is what I'm doing now is just squaring up for my my wellboard and uh, my aprons. Uh, this is a <clears throat> this is a 12 incher, well, a two by 12, which if you didn't know is 11 and, or um, inch and a half by 11 and a quarter, I think. And so I'm doing this. This is going to be one of, I'll have this and then two two by sixes uh, on either it, top and bottom of it that I'll made up and glue up for the rear apron. And then a two by 10 for the well. And then a two by 10 and a two by four for the front apron. So I'm just going to keep continuing to work. Uh, it's starting to cool off actually. Um, right now, I mean, I got the, this one, I, I got it flat. And then I tried to take twist out and it took away the flat. I was going, I'm going back and forth. I just forgot how long it took to do this. But it is what it is. And I, I kind of go, when I want to know, so right now, I'm high here and here. So what I do if I want to know, like, which end to take it off of, <clears throat> I just measure the, the ends, and there's more meat on that corner so Knots are hell on your on your irons. Golden. Huh. That was almost too good to be true.
So of course I gotta go back and make sure I'm flat. Which I don't think I'm that lucky. I'll we'll find out. And this is an apron, right? It doesn't have to be. I mean, I'm gonna, it's gonna be close no matter what, but it doesn't have to be like perfect. So all I'm doing is marking the high spots and <clears throat> frankly it's close enough where I could just leave it right where it's at but I'm going to make one more pass just take a few shavings where I marked it and we'll call this side face. Check it one last time with the sticks. <clears throat> yeah, I've learned my lesson. It's, uh, you, you may not believe it now, but your eyeball is probably more accurate than most measuring devices out there. You just got to trust your eyes. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop it right here. Just letting you know what I'm doing, where I'm at, where I sit. Friends and family love you. Everybody else. See you on the next clip.